Hey guys, so for this second episode, I'm going to turn Honey Bee Eats ASMR into a miniature. So I chose this mint kind of green themed. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so here I have some of my clay. First, we're going to make the ice cream cake. So I'm taking my white clay and I put it in my homemade waffle mold. And then I use my chalk pastel and I give some color so that it looks like an ice cream cone. And then I'm just rolling it up so that we can have a cone. And I'm taking a little bit of this mint colored clay. I know it's not that mint, but like, whatever. And I'm making the ice cream scoop here. I'm just giving some textures with my dotting tool. And yeah. And I also just put some textures on the top of that. And then what we're gonna do next is we are going to do it again with the needle tool to give it more sharp textures and also I put it put some almond foil too for a texture that's a lot of yeah and now we're gonna make the chocolate chip I just take a I rolled up a thin snake of brown clay and I just put it all over the ice cream for the chocolate chips so now we have mint chocolate chip ice cream cone and then I'm putting it slanted like this because it is going to be slanted that's what I see from the picture and I'm just sticking the cone even more with my needle tool needle tool needle tool and we're done with the ice cream now I rolled ball up some foil to make the cake because I don't want to waste a lot of polymer clay because polymer clays are expensive. So, and I just covered the foil with a tin layer, a thin layer of clay. Sorry, I can't talk. So, just cover the whole foil. And then what you want to do is just press it up. Make sure there are no foils pop out. And we're done. Now I'm taking this thin layer of brown clay and I just put it on top of the cake for that chocolate icing. And then, yeah. And then I added some tiny brown clay for the drip effect. And then I put the ice cream on top of it. And now we're going to make the cupcake. So I made a tiny ball of foil and I covered it with my brown clay. Because I don't have a lot of brown clay. And then you just want to roll it up. And we're going to make a cup shape. Because it's cupcake. And I draw... I, no. I made some details with needle tool. And then I'm making... It's kind of like an ice cream cone. But it's the cupcake icing. So I'm just basically doing the same thing. And then with some needle tool, I put some textures, and, I, and I'm using my ball tool, and then I'm just sticking it on. And for the cupcake, I'm making the icing because I don't have that piping tip, so I had to make my own with this dotting tool, and I twisted it, and then I just twist it and I just put it on top of that cupcake and I kind of failed it looks so ugly like what is that okay we're gonna make the ice cream bar and just take a tiny piece of popsicle stick you just want to cut it thin piece of popsicle stick and then get a brown clay and just wrap it around the stick and then that's it that's really easy so now we have four pieces and one fail so now i'm taking this two balls of clay and we're gonna stuck it poke it with this popsicle stick 
and then we're done. We're like, this is a cake pop. And then I'm just adding some more clay because it doesn't look like a ball. It's not a perfect ball, so. And then I rolled up the thin piece of white clay and then I added and I stick it around the circle clay to make ice cream in a cup. And I just cut out the excess, smooth it, and smooth everything with my dotting tool. And then for the handle, just thin piece of clay and just stick it on. And I didn't know that the color of the ice cream is actually white color. It's a vanilla flavor. But yeah, I ended up using a green colored clay because I didn't know. I didn't know that. So I'm sorry, but that's okay. Yeah, I kind of messed up here. And I just roll it up to make it thin. So here I'm doing the ice cream scoop and just do some textures with my needle tool and blah 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 like that. And then just stick it on top and we're done. Okay, now after I baked it, it's time to put some glaze on top of the clay so that it would look glossy. This is the cake pops. The cake pops are the easiest thing for me. The ice, the ice cream bar, the cupcakes. And the ice cream in the cup. So that is it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And please let me know any video ideas. So that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. And this is a, an overview of the projects, objects that I did. So, yeah, bye. I also wanted to tell you that I know that these don't look like they'll look similar at all. So.